Hey guys, how are we going? And hey, welcome back to another episode of this Cricket 22 career mode. In today's episode, we are continuing on with this first test match against New Zealand at the SCG. Uh, in the last episode, we picked up 296 runs with uh, ourselves scoring 92 of 135, our highest score to date with these new sliders. So uh, top scoring there, always nice to see. They ran controversially three out and out bowlers with Devin Conway bowling five overs for some reason. And in reply, 18 overs gone, New Zealand none for 72, we've bowled one over, we're going to get back down to the action and try and take a few poles. Right, let's go. First ball of the episode, going quite aggressive on the offside as per. Oh, it's inside edge onto, this, onto the pad. If uh, that one snuck through, we could have been on very early and that would have been fantastic. They're still trailed by 222 here. Driven. Conway looking to play his shots here, 42 of 62, Latham 30 of 55. They've started very positive here, and we'll be trying to, uh, to of course, stop this partnership. Oh, another drive, nice, bowling absolute gas, 149 k's an hour here. Well, we're back, we're bowling to 31st, none for 109, this partnership flying. Not what we want. Oh, another inside edge. Kind of picks up a boundary, moves on to 57, Latham on 54. This is a great start from the Kiwis. Can't believe another inside edge. Way too many inside edges for my liking here. Let's go again. Driven. Mid on there. Don't usually have a mid on in, but hey, we've got him there. Saved us some runs. Conway's weaker skill. Special shots. That old chestnut. Let me know your thoughts in the comments. What do I even bowl or try to set a field for to try and get him out with his weaker skill being special shots? It just feels like a bit of a cop out and I can't really do too much to try and bolt his weakness because... Special shots, not really a weakness, you just don't play them, right? So, look, I don't know. Freeman picked up a wicket, got Latham, and he was out stumped. Unbelievable. Very tough to get stumpings in this game. Oh, jeez, this could be a wad. Yep, spray can first up. Williamson out to the creases on four. They must bat very deep if they only used three out and out bowlers. Or the captaincy was in the bin, but, you know, Kane's a great captain. He wouldn't be doing that. So, they could be looking to bat long and score bulk runs. Oh, what a delivery. Short sharp spells here. Not that we're doing much. 2 for 159, Conway 70. Williamson gone, James the new batter. He's on 10. Leaves that one. First real leave we've seen all day. First time bowling to James. Wicker skill, the glance, not helping us too much. Not really looking to bowl too straight at the moment. Whoa, what a ball. What was he trying to do there? I want to have another look here. What kind of shot was he playing? Good length. Oi, he was, he was so, just nowhere near the ball there. Great, uh, a great dick length, some would say. And uh, just, uh was humming. Pass, James. That's uh, another inside you for four. Second one of the uh, the bowling spell, eight runs off in inside edges, none for 20. Last ball. And of course they leave it. Not a great start. Uh, can we bounce back? We're back, but as time's passed. Eight overs, one made in, uh, none for 20. Five for two, four, eight. Four overs until the new ball. Looks pretty late on in day two. Probably a couple overs to go. Trouble 48. Nichols 45. Wilson 24. Still yet to uh, grab a wicket here. Oh, once again, straight on the dot with those areas. This ball must be uh, pretty cooked at the moment. I mean, that side just looks absolutely done. Looks like it's been on the road and someone's just dragged it along a gravel road. Oh, piss, that's four. Uh, probably should end up changing my field here since they're quite set and we're bowling trash. Oh, he's edged onto his pad and then almost roll into the stumps interesting close hopefully we get to bowl oh looks like it's a new day right now yeah walking out looks like we're going to be bowling the first over of the day we'll keep the field Nichols 49 two overs until the new ball so we should be bowling the first uh over with the new pill that's good hopefully we can uh, get the ball to talk a bit and we can finally pick up a wicket because any danger Drives out well, no run. Here we go. 
Brand new pill, new kookaburra. Now, I think I might add in one more slip. I'll take our mid on. Let's run it. Outswing, straight up. Nickel's 49. Oi, great start. Oh, absolutely done him there. He was so far away from the ball there. Let's go again. Another outswing delivery. Surely just a little tickle through to the keeper. Oh, another great drive. Oh, they're going for it. Oh, how is that? If they're appealing, I think it's out. They're going upstairs here. Oh, this could be stupid. I think that's out, isn't it? Erasmus was in a good call, but it's quite looks quite tight. He's gone. He is gone. Yep. Good throw. Silly run. It didn't really put a lot of effort in. Where was the dive? Just run himself out for 53. Freeman. Love that. New batter, Jameson. The all-rounder. Can we get him early? Tristan Wilson is on strike right now. Oh, straight away. Goes expansive. Still trail by 36. Six down. They should get a lead here. It uh, only depends how much is that lead going to be. Oh, it's a noey. It's bullshit for me. Oh, oh, what? <laughs> what? How did we get that? Oh, man, that is stiff. Oh, no. Wilson. Goes to 32 of 91. Tim Southey. Oh, here we go. Well, let's take another closer look here because this is a comedy of errors. Inside edge onto the pads. Yep. Hits the pad, ricochets off, and hits a middle stump. I don't think I've seen that before. That is a comical uh, comical way to get out. Look at that. The ball's almost trying to get through. It just settles in between middle and off. There we go. Love that. That's out. And that's our first wicket. See how the wicket skill is sweep. I'm not going to be sweeping here, mate. Anyway, 1 for 34. Last ball of the 13th. And leaves it. New Zealand 7 for 2, 6, 8. How's that? That's out. Yep, he's walking off. He's done the old manus. He just starts walking off as soon as or as soon as the appeal goes up. He's like, yep, I know I'm pretty cooked here. Are we going to see a referral? No. I mean, when you start walking off, you know you're pretty cooked. I reckon that's hit him outside. That has hit him outside the line. And he's just started walking off. Let's take a look here. Actually, no. Do you know what would be better? If I actually go to Big Eye. Let's take a look. Oh, no. In line. Umpire's cool. Oh, man. I mean, marginal. But you're out, mate. Here we go. 2 for 34. New bowler. A new batter. Or who is a bowler? Daniel. We can skill the cut. Oh, you're taking the piss. Full toss. It's almost cannon into off stump. It's, uh, I can't believe it. Bit of swing, very late. Yep. Close. Oh, mate. Trying to turn it onto the leg side, outside off. That one was a leg cutter, so I was trying to go in. Didn't jag in enough. Oh, he got a hold of that one. He's going for it too. That's some pretty shite fielding. Well, walking out to bat. 41.560 average. It is day... 11.30 on day 4 uh, 273 New Zealand got all out for we are now 5 for 253 off 84 and a half overs look they've only used the 3 bowls once again that is so weird no spin 3 seamers street 48 man 127 elf 246 deliveries English 24 of 34 what's the lead 276 day 4 what do you want to do I mean we probably want to bat until T maybe I don't know. Knowing how their first innings went, runs should not be... Uh, well, if we get like 300, 350, I'll be pretty happy with that, to be fair. On an aging pitch, that might be enough, but you can never take the fourth innings for granted because we do see some weird stuff pop up. So maybe we just bat. We just, we just bat and see how we go because knowing me, I probably won't last that long anyway. Um, although... We've seen them pretty well this test match. There we go. We've got Daniel charging in. Coming into the attack. Yet his, his stamina is pretty cooked. 
Bob 26, he tried the front foot pull and it didn't go well. Um, still eight balls without scoring a run. It's alright though. It's alright. No! Yep. I'm going for that. Dive. My goodness. Bit going on there. Bit too unpacked, although we're not going to because we just picked up a single and that's alright. The lead's now to 290. Up around 290. Daniel, a bit unlucky, hasn't uh, taken many poles. Yep. Don't know why I pulled that. Worked out pretty well though. Do we go two? I'm gonna go two. Bloody cheeky. Oh, it's a shot. Just expecting our fielder to be there. I'm gonna go two. They're thrown to my end, but we'll get there comfortably. Moving on to five off 11, that's a, it's a start. Tell you what though, looks like an absolute full house here at the ECG. How good is test cricket? Pull another on the legs, please, Daniel. Shot. Just a single out there. We'll continue to rotate the strike if necessary. Well, it is necessary. But I think almost the time. 11.58, day four. Do we give ourselves a whole of day five to try and get him out? I've never, I don't think I've ever played in a drawn test match. Definitely a possibility now, though. Got Southy bowling. Solid. Shot. Moved across. Not at mid wicket, so easy pickings there. Probably pick up three. Actually, might go for four. Oh, that is a superhuman dive out there. It's unreal. Picked up three though. Moving on to a nine and starving English of the strike. Daniel continuing to charge in here. Poor bloke. Only three bowls being used, and he's absolutely done. And he continues to get runs hit against him. That one should go for four. That should be our first boundary of the innings. Moving on to 13 there, thank you, the leg glance coming in, coming in clutch in this uh, with these sliders. Daniel just ate away from his 100. Oh, it has been absolutely crunched. Just one though. Although, two. I'm going to go two because they're taking quite long out there. Don't have the bowls in, but we'll get there quite easily. Moving on to 16, runs are flowing now. Run rate 3.05, I think the lead's just gone over 300. 307. Solid, no run there. Poor bowls, they've still got three or two more tests after this to bowl. Surely they have to come in and have some more bowlers, or I don't know what they've got to do. Just bring in a spinner at least, just to mix it up. Because these guys are going to be absolutely cooked. Kind of feeling uh, aggressive here if it's full, half fully areas. Nope. That might be a wide. I really want to go through mid wicket because there's no one there. Yep, given a wide. So if it's. Oh, they changed the field up again. Although short mid, we could probably clear him. See what we, what we can do. Yeah. We can. We've clipped him, clipped it over him quite nicely. Timing early, but it doesn't matter when he's in that short. No, we won't go for four, but we'll go for three. Although, we're going to run four here. We've just run four. That fielding needs a bit of work. Move on to 20. I think now we might have enough runs. 312. There we go. Just bowling into the slot there. That's the worst possible wall you could bowl with, with that field. Anyway, that might go for another four. Do we run four again? We've just run two fours in a row. Poor... Lads, the stamina must be cooked. Yep. Okay, be four. Just four to square there. Yeah, timed it well. That's the Australian 300. Moving on to 29 there. I think if we get to 400, I think we just might we might just call it. Give ourselves a, maybe a day and a bit to try and bowl them out. Yeah. Oh, it could be four more. We've gone the other side now. Go the ball. Go the ball! Awesome. 50 on partnership. It's a... Uh, we're going better than I thought we would. Although these bowls, to be fair, are cooked. Look, Daniels does it, has no stamina. Surely he gets injured. Yep. Oh, straight drives. Oh, this is just cruel now. Poor bowls. Uh, we'll take two, though. Moving on to 35. Jameson bowling. We're on 38 of 38. Nice. Nice. Yep. That's what happens when I try and talk the batting up. It goes to shit. That was a nothing shot, to be fair. Don't know what the fuck we're doing. But now we've probably fucked ourselves up, so... That was such a yuck. Oh, boy. He's gone straight through him there. Gotta take a replay of that, because that's uh, quite humorous. 30 out of 39, 5 falls. Good strike rate. We've still got Cameron Green to come in. And he had the innings to give quite nicely last... Uh, last innings. Let's take a look and see what happened to first slip. 
it's kind of uh like holding hands it's it's like art that is like art beautiful and let's just see what happens here oh oh well hello oh he's gone for man that bloke who, who is that guy henry nichols he's got a face full of latham and a face full of kane it's a black cap sandwich and there's a bit going on there here we go nice wickets at 13.29 best of five for five piss take where the areas here two for 21 though we've started well three four five they made uh nice not many not many more runs after that sort of capitulated there but yeah only three bowls used so there were four and now conway duck williamson nine james and latham at the crease they need 347 runs to win stay four still it's three o'clock so we're in the oh this could be tea soon i think it might be tea soon can we snag another one before the session ends that's what i left green got james so nichols and latham at the crease here three for 22. not looking good for the kiwis here drops that one on the up uh yeah look i'd say winvers is currently 99 percent to australia have to go get a decent partnership to change the result potentially that's a good shot though from latham nice little late cut i think he's gonna pick up four there no, oh, this could be a run out. Surely. Got him. Yeah! Nichols did it again. He did it in the first innings. And he's done it again. I'm, I reckon it's Freeman as well. Does this bloke not learn? I'll tell you what, those dives between, uh, who was it? Conway and. Conway and Williamson, who went straight through Nichols, have certainly done something to the old head here. Because. Why? Has he not learned? The memory was wiped. He tried it again. And he's exactly the same run out in the first innings. Oh boy. Anyway, good for us. 4 for 31. New Zealand are struggling. And we're cruising towards uh, the first win of the series. Cut away. Oh, it's a good shot. Another nice shot there from Latham. We'll go for another four. Latham's gone. Blundell has been joined by Wilson. Oh, it's four. Jeez, that's gone off the edge at a great rate of knots. First boundary for Blundell. Tristan Wilson, you two score a run. 5.48 though, makes for grim reading. What is that shot? How's the foot movement on him? Well, oh well. That was quite anti climatic. Uh, one by 295 runs. 73 all out. Dry Richardson played the match. For a 61 knot, plus he took 5 for 13. So let's take a look at the scorecard here. So first innings for us, 92 of 135. Dry, 61 not out. Good stuff there. The lower order wagged and uh, wagged well. Uh, we had a bowl. Bowled up. 2 for 35 of 15. Jared Freeman, uh, 3 for 46. Nice little barbecue in there from Nichols. So we had another bat, 38 of 39. Got a bit cocky and played a shit shot. 3 for 5 all out. And then in reply, Nichols cooked himself again. We didn't take a wicket. Picked up none for 17 off 7. Uh, Freeman 1 for 10. Dry 5 for 13 off 7.3. We take the first test match. Going to go 1 0 up in the series with two matches to play. And if that's anything to go by from this result, then that could be quite comprehensive. So uh, next up, going to be playing the Boxing Day test at the MCG. Get around it. Good stuff there. Is there anything to us to look at? 95 overall. Uh, still got those two test matches to go. Then we've got some ODIs in uh, Pakistan. Of uh, no, we're playing in Pakistan during our summer. Nice. Uh, yeah, there we go. Anyway, that'll be it for today's episode. Thank you so much for watching. If you enjoyed today's episode, please leave a like and subscribe. If you are feeling up to it, leave a comment down below. Always appreciate reading those. But uh, until then, take it easy.